Hello, what's up? I'm here just for a quickie because I wanted to show you Ocean Master at rank 4. And I think I can forego these two guys and take these two guys in. And that should still be enough. Um, at rank 5 on the main account he works wonders as an out of turn attacker but here I bring him because of the shields because Brainiac can take care of himself but we want all the other characters to have some shields on and this is a quick build for newbies, uh, once you start farming red alerts, you should have uh, Swamp Thing available and the rest, uh, well, Ocean Master has low damage and he looks even crappier here because everybody else on my team is gear 8 and he is still just gear 4. Tomorrow I should be able to bring him up to speed. So tomorrow you should be you should have a, a video available of Ocean Master. Uh, with his upgrades and full gear, full level. Uh, this one looks fun. Level 45s. But I'm gonna need Satana here. Uh, because I want to have somebody else to porch besides. Ocean Master and his legendary upgrade with um, with the speed ups makes him very good. Yeah, this guy just has level and doesn't have gear. I shouldn't be able to damage him like this but this is the thing if somebody gets out of control ocean master bring him in line and now i have first strike capability and he can take up to uh, 50 percent turn meter So that's what you want him for. Okay, everybody gets healed. And once we get rid of Superman, we are off to the races. I have to control that Doomsday. Yes, because he's going to get out of control real quick. If I leave him like that. Now, of course, uh, rank 5. Nice. Uh, a rank 5 Ocean Master is better at forging. Now, I don't want this guy taking a turn just yet. And boy, he becomes hard to kill real fast. This one should do enough damage.
Oh, God. Took too long. Before taking care of him. And it's not that Doomsday is super difficult to deal with, but at this low level. And Satan is going down to. Oh, barely. Let's give her some shield. It's just. The Doomsday rework is real good and I lack the tools to deal with him and he's just getting more and more health every time he uses his basic he just gets ah. there that was my mistake It's not that Doomsday is that good, I played wrong. Sometimes you just have to admit when you screw up. And it costed me one of my better tunes. Well, at least the only legendary on this low level account. There you go. But I still have others. I can, uh, I'm gonna be, be losing leadership, but I can still play, I just have to be very careful from now on, Why, what team I choose to take on, and for example, well, I no longer have this guy, but I can go inside with him. It would be better if I had had Jordan. So I have a big measure of control with this guy. Look, he was about to use his AOE, now he's back to back to the end of the queue. And by the time he's able to use his AOE, ah, that was lucky. That was real lucky. going to get better and your teammates get more HP so that way they get more shield. So it's probably going to be a good idea if you bring someone else along with Ocean Master that can give shields to the whole team. And I'm going to leave this one right here uh, I'm just going to do my heroics a quick farm for princess shards and, and Jordan is now for the first time in the game available through the common PvP packs and he almost gets leader. Uh, yeah, like this. I bought energy and uh, if you watch the other video, uh, I was able to two star the fifth node. So now I'm able or I will be able to farm 15 shards per day and that's 90 more days that's 90 and 45 135 shards 
just from this so again at least a legendary 2 character from doing both events as a newbie it, it was very very difficult to finish this node and I lost my siren on the first wave but I, I, I didn't have problems trouble at all finishing actually finishing the node so there is that and that's with mostly greens so I imagine if I bring my oh I'm about to level up again well it's probably going to level up after a few after a few more more notes but yeah a month and a half and almost level 52 that's why i consider anything below 60 to be newbie stuff that's low level accounts that's not this but uh, it's real easy real real easy to level up nowadays everything gives you experience and just from the process of grinding normally you are going to have uh, a lot of money and gems and everything so there is that this was the quickie just to show you how ocean master plays and i really should bring well you want to get at least his level level six basic so it's two buffs that he purges and uh, well yes at least uh, level seven uh, blockade in the arm range at least a level four it doesn't do a ton of damage and these of course both passives highest you can because these are uh, random number ch chances and I think the weakest yeah the the weakest upgrade for for ocean master is going to be this the the first passive because it's a 50 percent chance to apply silence which is not very helpful and it's only if they get buffs if you happen to face a team that doesn't buff at all uh, you're going to be getting extra turns through this through arcane torrent and arcane torrent it's also a 50 percent chance but it's of using his basic after every ally turn if that ally has shield and with a high enough ocean master i don't think you will have trouble keeping shields on your teammates the whole round well that was a quickie this is low level ocean master rank 4 so he's usable at least for red alerts at low level so get yourself one of these if you are a new player and there will be videos coming up with a legendary ocean master at full gear at full uh, skills and level 70 that's all for today see you again the next time keep grinding on